And welcome back. We are on part 18 of What is Tsunade Adopted Naruto. I'm thinking we might actually be able to finish it up this week. Um, along with, uh, actually, yeah, now that I think about it, saying it a lot, I think we might be able to finish out both this one and Goku having a sister one. So, we'll see what happens. Because I'm going to get at least three uh, different chapters of this one out this week. Or have at least enough room to do so. Uh, and have at least enough room to do at least two uh, more of the uh, Goku having a sister one. But, we continue on from where left. So, last we left off, last time on Naruto, what if, part, what if draw... Tsunade adopted Naruto, part 18. Naruto and the gang have just come back from capturing the Three Tails. The Three Tails, though, was sealed away. Inside, Gurin. Oh yes, Gurin is now canon in this storyline, and she's a Three Tailed Jinjuriki. Oh yeah, we go, we went there. She's also remaining a part of the village hidden in the waves. And I'm doing a little, not, a little um, relationship with the Mizukage Mei and Zabuza, because why not? Um, but when we got back, we found out that Sasuke was gone. Now, what happened? Well, truth be told, I had misspoke <laughs> in the last chapter, but I th I'm rolling with it. Don't think I'm not rolling with it. So, what actually had previously happened? Well, uh, first off, we have to understand how long it pro that mission probably took to understand why I'm able to kind of put the placing of events where they are. There, they never again said how long it actually takes to get to the wave, but you had to pack. They, uh, I think uh, Kakashi even said pack for a couple, at least of, like a week or two or something along those lines. Uh, so you have to assume it's at least a, probably like a few days to a week's trip to get there because it's not close to the hidden leaf. It's not far, but it's not close. And then the amount of time you actually spend there, plus the amount of time, at, plus the amount of time coming back. If I were to be a betting man for this, for the sake of a reasonable storytelling, we're going to say that um, it's about a month and a half. I think that's fair. Like, it's between, it takes maybe like a week or two to get there. Probably about a week. Uh, a week to actually get there. And then it's, you know, so that's two weeks right off the bat. So that's a, that's half that's half a month gone. And then a month actually staying there doing the mission and probably, you know, lingering and, you know, you know, uh, shooting the crap. So, what's happening in that month and a half? Well, the entire uh, Hidan Kakuzu incident happens where Ozma is killed. Uh, you get Shikamaru doing his thing. Uh, thing. He, him and Team 10 are going to go rogue, try to take them out. Kakashi offers his assistance. But more importantly, Team 7 offers its assistance. It's not just Kakashi in this case. It is Team 7. So, it, it, because Sasuke and Hinata are there. So... They, uh, Sasuke and Inata are both, uh, laying, in, laying back, basically. You get a lot of the interactions with, uh, uh, Hidon and Kakuzu that you did initially, where, you know, Shikamaru is able to get rid of Hidon, but Kakuzu is a tough opponent for Kakashi, just he's about to, you know, just as he's about to, you know, deliver that combination of wind and fire technique. Uh, was it wind or fire? Was it fire and lightning? I can't remember which one he was using a combination of. Sasuke and Hinata both come in. It's like, oh, I feel, I thought it, it thought it was too convenient. It was just you. So you so you brought others, Kakashi. And then Sasuke goes, oh, I knew Hidon's, uh, Hidon's character would be the death of him. Uh, and you know, Sasuke comes in. And Sasuke and Kakashi alone are able to at least keep the tendrils of the... Uh, the grunge, what was it? Oh, God, the grunge fear. I can't remember exactly what the... Something grunge. I can't remember the exact name of Kakuzu's technique. But it was the secret technique of the hidden waterfall that he stole. Uh, and, he, you know, the, using the lightning, they're able to cut the tendrils. Between fire and the amount of techniques that Kakashi knows, that he's, they're able to keep that at bay. Hinata, they're able to use Hinata. So, in the conjunction, because they're Team 7, they work together. Hinata's able to get in there and actually, you know, hit chakra points, which he would still have. Uh, and eventually they do put uh, down Kakuzu. Uh, so, that though, there's no, see, again, it's all a matter of interpretation, because there's no actual indication of how long between the mission where they find, uh, between, because uh, Naruto was learning his wind release, le basically learning wind release and learning to create the wind Rasen Shuriken, and wind Rasengan. There's no indication how long that actually took, but I'm guessing it took or at least a month. Something along those lines. Maybe if, at least a few weeks. At least. Um, so, you, since that's all taken care of, 
Now what had happened prior to that? So this is probably still about two weeks before Naruto gets back. Well, first off, we have to know what's going on with Orochimaru at this point. Because at this point in the story, or the whole issue with Orochimaru had kind of resolved itself for the time being. Sasuke had beaten him. Well, Orochimaru doesn't have another body. Doesn't have Sasuke to take the body of. So who does he take the body of this time? This time, I think he does, in fact, take Sugetsu. I think he does take him. So now he gains the liquid, liquidization technique of the uh, Hozoki clan. I think that's the name of his uh, clan. So he has that. But now, and so now, he, right now, he can't aim for Sasuke because even with that technique, he's still got to face the whole village to get Sasuke or Hinata. So, but right now, he has a new body. So that's that's not an issue. He, they, Sasuke or Hiroshimaru knew that going after either of them at this point now would be a little, uh, wouldn't, wouldn't add up. He does, he's lacking the resources, he's lacking the manpower, but now that he's got a, a new uh, Keke Genkai on him, or at least clan technique, it's never actually known if that was a Keke Genkai or if it was just a clan technique. I'm inclined to think a Keke Genkai because we see it with each member of his clan, uh, but it's never registered as one, so I'm gonna say it's a clan technique. Uh, so, which means a clan, and remember, a clan technique is different from a Keke Genkai. A Keki Genkai is something you're born with. It's in your blood. It's in your DNA. A clan technique is something anyone can use. It's just usually limited to that specific clan. Anyone could, in theory, learn the Shadow Clone Jutsu. Oh, Shadow, excuse me. The Shadow Possession Jutsu. It's just, it's a trademark mark, uh, trademark, trademark of the Nara clan. Um, so, you have that going on. But now, you, you get an interesting thing going on here. Uh, Sasuke probably taking a little bit of time, you know, after that, after that tough mission, you know, going, you know, spending time with his girlfriend, because him and Sakura are a thing in this version, and Sakura, by the by, I did, I actually gave, threw her some bones in this one, she's not usually, granted, she's not a main focus, so we don't get to her that often, but when we do, she's not a weakling, I gave Sakura an actual, you know, a decent boost in this one, she's got, she's a Master Genjutsu user at this point, Especially, she's probably the top one since Kuruna has pretty much retired on maternal leave. Because, um, as far as we know, she never went back to being a ninja. Uh, and she's got she's a decent fire user. She's got a little bit of main, uh, medical ninjutsu on her belt. She's also a pretty capable hand to hand fighter, not like Lee or anyone else, but it turns she can hold her own in a fight. She's a capable ninja. Um, you know, something that you really needed to not crap on her Gijimoto. She wasn't a good character to begin with. You needed to make her a good character first. But, you know, whatever. Uh, I digress. So, I, I liken the situation to a scenario I did in a different what if. It was just Sasuke was not going to spoil who he was with. He was with someone else in this scenario. But I imagine it'd be Sasuke. It's, it's night. And let's say it's a couple days prior to it. In fact, let's even say it's just the day before Naruto came back, which would make sense. Um, that Sasuke, you know, wakes up and he's, you know, he's in bed and he sees Sakura there sleeping next to him. And, you know, he has a, has a nice little, a, a bit of a, not a pale smile. It's a very, a very real, yet smile, like that very, like, satisfied, a, a very satisfied, just, hmm, I was like, this, this is a good life I have kind of smile. I was like, I'm happy. I found someone I love who loves me back. Uh, I'm happy. You know, and then all of a sudden, he hears a, hears a car, and then he gets up, puts underwear on, because they probably were doing it, and then, you know, they were sleeping naked, like you might do. You know, and some, and some people just sleep in the nude. No judging. It's refreshing. Not that I know. Or do I? <laughs> that's not an image you need, folks. Um, I digress. Again, that's kind of one of my trademark uh, sayings. I digress. <laughs> Put it on a shirt! Um, <laughs> I heard someone, uh, someone... Side check real quick, digressing again. I heard I had someone in the comments basically put like, you know, back at the plot, you should make that a shirt. Uh, you know, if I ever if we ever do get into making merchandise, I do it. That'd definitely be one. And then I digress. Now it had to be preceded by some sort of funny thing prior to that, but <laughs> um yeah, uh I, I could see me making sure of that. Anyway, yeah, he hears a crow, so he gets up, looks out the window. A, br a crow basically lands, but then materializes into a message. A Genjutsu message, which uh, luckily Sasuke can knows it's a Genjutsu, that's not going to hurt him. But it's clearly a message, and he clearly knows it's from Itachi. And he's basically saying, "Brother, you, I've, hey, brother, it's it's time. If you think you if you think you can revenge our family, or avenge our mother and father, 
Avenger clan. Then meet me at said point at said time. Da 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 da. Uh, and you know Sasuke, you know, in the crowd disappears. So Sasuke, you know, is now conflicts like I could leave, but you know, my, I have my I have my friends. I have, Naruto should be getting them back soon. I have conscious sense, I should do this, but this is my this is my. I, I don't want to do this alone. Oh no, I I want to do this alone to avenge my family, but at the same time, I also know how strong Itachi is, and that I I'm not alone in this. I don't have to be alone in this. So, so, but Sasuke's like, there's no telling if Itachi will still be there. So basically, what he does is he leaves a message for Sakura saying, I'm ha I'll am i be gone. I'm it Basically explains the scenario and saying that when you get the, when you get this, bring it to the Akage, right? Tell her I had no choice. We can't guarantee he's going to be there forever. He'll be waiting for me probably for only so long. So, and then when, it, so basically that's where we left off. So, we have we have basically Team Seven, and we'll have Team Eight come there because that was what the original uh, group was in Shippuden was Team Eight and Team Seven. So you had Tenzo and Kakashi this time. He's, his name is Tenzo, but Yamato, Yamato and Kakashi. Uh, there is no Kurunai because she wasn't there to begin with. But you have Shino, Shikamaru, uh, Shino, Shikamaru, Shino, Kiba, and uh, Sakura there. So they head out to go and rescue Sasuke. Sasuke, meanwhile, has already met up with Itachi, and, and, and Itachi's like, so little brother, tell me, did you, uh, oh, tell me, have you acquired enough hate, only your hatred, <laughs> so basically, matter, only your hatred can defeat me, um, and then Sasuke, surprisingly, it's like, I have acquired, I think I have acquired enough, but not of hate, I, I thought along a hard on, uh, brother, and though I hate you, you, I still love you. You're still my brother, and I don't want—I don't want to kill you if I don't have to. Despite all what you've done, I've—I I haven't lived solely for the purpose of killing you, like you said. To which Itachi's eyes actually do widen, uh, surprise a little bit, because he assumed that Sasuke would have. But I mean, and he kind of got that impression a little bit when they briefly met during the Gara rescue arc. But now he's clearly seeing that Sasuke isn't that kid anymore. Sasuke is a grown man. Uh, I mean, by ninja state, but he's, he's 16, 17 going on there. So by that, by all those standards, he's a grown man. And they can see this is a grown man. And he, Sasuke continues like, I hate you for so long, but then I found people, people I can care about. I found a family and I will do everything in my power to protect that family. And she, so if I must kill you, I will. But if I, but I'd rather bring you in the, and bring you in the back alive so you could face justice. <laughs> face justice for what you did. I'm not an Avenger. I, sir, I'm... I am not an Avenger, brother. I am... I am... You know, I, I actually just thought that off of my head. I Because he thinks... He, he considered himself an Avenger, but it's clearly not what he was going for. Um, So... A, it, or it's clearly not where he led up. He was more a, a, re, a revenger, if you will. He was more hell bent on revenge, a psychopath, if you will, <laughs> uh, to some degree. But no, I was like that. So more or less, he'd be like uh, more or less his line of dialogue would probably be something more akin like as he pulls out his uh, you know ch white chakra blade and he fun funnels chakra into it, his white uh, you know his, his lightning chakra as it lights up and extends. And it's like I'm going to bring you back for the punishment you deserve. And sir, so you could face down for everything you've done, brother. That is what it means to be a true Avenger. To which Itachi actually has a little bit of a smile, feeling a bit of pride in his brother. It's like so be it, Sasuke. And then they clash. Now you'll have that whole Genjutsu confrontation. That's 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 a given. Uh, and eventually it will subside, and then you will basically have Sasuke, um, uh, Sasuke, and him clashing in actual ninjutsu. Now Sasuke doesn't have all the same techniques he originally had. Like, I don't think he has, like, all those seals on his arm with all the shuriken in there. I don't think he has that. But he's um, extremely well trained up, including probably knowing of not just fire and lightning jutsu, but probably knowing a couple of water and earth jutsu as well, though his primaries are fire and lightning. So, you know, he creates an earth style, like, mud wall to block the shur incoming shuriken. He then uses a Chidori spear, blasts right through the rock wall, because earth is weak to lightning, and then just kind of raises it through. Itachi has to dodge, but but uh, it's, uh, as there's a hole, Sasuke's actually peering through the hole as he's doing it, just then creating the Chidori spear, uh, ch not the Chidori spear, because he's already doing that. I can't remember exactly. Was that the Chidori spear where basically he stabbed Itachi's body? It was a Genjutsu, but he stabbed the body, 
and then he like spears Jez now. He does that, and just, just Itachi actually has the avoids like, crap. All of a sudden, Sasuke is fires their fireball jutsu, boof, blasting him with a fireball jutsu. Uh, but they clash using Amaterasu next, which ugh, that's that's a tough call. And it's like that's that's a tough one if he can get through there, and uh, if Sasuke can uh, bounce back from that or not. Sasuke quickly thinking just you know uses a uses a chidori to just crack through the earth basically he's tunneling he's kind of like just doing a knuckles basically where he tunnels on the earth just do 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 and then basically he's up here trying to find out exactly where itachi is unfortunately he doesn't have the best earth sense but he has a general location and he nearly clips itachi so itachi basically <laughs> they're both starting to huff and puff basically fires the fireball dragon, the great fi grand fire dragons. I can't remember the name of that technique. The technique that sets up Kieran. And basically now it's like, uh, you've given me no choice, but I want to take you alive. But, you, but I have to take you dead. Kieran! And then, you know, boom, and some brings Kieran down. Susano is activated. Now, it's like, so tell me, brother, do you have anything left in you? <sighs> Crap. Uh, I don't, I don't. And then, you know, he tries to charge. It's like, it is over, brother. Totska Blade. Uh, which, I mean, Itachi clearly isn't going to legitimately kill Sasuke, but maybe he's hoping he'll activate something by taking the Tosuke Blade at him. So, uh, you know, he throws the Tosuke Blade straight at him, and there's a there's a giant cling-clang boom sound. Cut over to what the other guys were doing. Uh, oh yeah, we're bouncing around, baby. Uh, so we had, now there is no Team Hawk, or Snake in this case, it wasn't Team Heavy, uh, it was Team, well, there is none, there's no Jungo, Jugo, there's no Karin, there's no <laughs> uh, Sugetsu. Instead, what's going on here is that Toby, uh, Obito, is tr trying to stall them as he was, because he, you know, he learned about this, because, uh, um, you know. He's advantageous to him to learn about this and, you know, use to his advantage. Unfortunately, in this version, I do think at least Kakashi and Naruto are able to get out, get, like, get away from him. Like, and Obito, even he's like, crap, they've gotten quite, that boy's gotten quite strong and Kakashi's still a pain as ever. But still, but still, I guess we'll have to, I'll have to deal with these two, uh, this group instead, while, uh, while Kasame deals with the other. Because Kasame's still there. So, you know, Naruto and Kakashi are running off. Meanwhile, they're all trying to hit Toby. Nothing's working. Um, and uh, like, and then Kasami's like, oh, well, I guess so. You guys actually made it past Toby. Which I think Kasami knows Toby. In this version, Kasami knows Toby's there. And plus, Kasami kind of likes Toby. He feels he brightens up the gloomy organization that's them. Uh, so I think they're they're a little buddy-buddy. And plus, I think he actually does know the, who Toby really is, too. Uh, at least in terms of who he because he knew him as the Mizukage. Uh, so I think he knows basically who Toby Obito slash Madara is. Uh, obviously he's not Madara, he just goes under that lit pretense. Um so you know Kasame and Naruto classic like, oh so you got the Kiba blades, huh kid? <laughs> oh this is gonna be good. Let's see what see how well you use them. But all of a sudden Kakashi just comes in using us using a, like some kind of like how um um, uh, uh, Gein and Bleach kind of tied up Kenpachi with that ribbon. Kind of uses something similar to grab the, uh, Samahata. And it's like, go Naruto. I'll take, I'll keep an eye. I'll take care of Kasai. Is that, <laughs> uh, it's like, oh, come on. You let my, you let the kid get away. I was about to have some fun. Not every day I get to fight another swordsman. Uh, but I guess the copy ninja Kakashi will do just fine. Now it's like, how about this? And Shin, he just, Sharing gun, yeah. How about that? And the, he's not even playing. He's like, he's got a Kamui ready just in case. So they go toe to toe, uh, and so they're duking out for a little bit. Now does Kasa does Kakashi actually kill Kasame? Uh, that's tough. Um, actually, you know what? I think he might do. <laughs> this would piss Kasame off to no end. Even though he probably still have a bit of it left, and that bit would still work. Well, actually, no, because it is a sentient sword. <laughs> you know, Kasami comes in, maybe with a water club, tries to basically take out Kakashi, who just looks behind him, Kamui Sama! <laughs> and it's like, Kasami, Sama's just dead now, just, and Kasami's just, my, my, my play, how did you, son of a, and then Kakashi just almost comes in with a lethal strike for a lightning blade, Kasami has to get the hell out of the way, and I might say Kakashi, this is Kasami, Kakashi, he just, <laughs> 
And, um, <laughs> and basically just, he gets a nice guess, like, oh, you're dead. You are dead. <laughs> and then basically he can't merge. It's, he can't merge with uh, the sword anymore. So now he's a little, um, he's a little bit of a bind. Because let's all, be honest. I actually don't think Kasami could have beaten Kakashi. Kakashi's too varied in style. He also had Kamui. Uh, I don't think he was capable of beating Kakashi. And I think Itachi even said that later on. Is that it would not have been a good matchup for him. Uh, Itachi even said Kasami couldn't beat Jiraiya. And Itachi would be hard-pressed to beat Jiraiya. That's how strong Jiraiya was. Kakashi wasn't quite Jiraiya, but he was still in that area. And maybe not Sonin, but he was definitely make the next step below. Um, so cut to, cream! and, you know, and, uh, Itachi is legitimately sh surprised, like, uh, so you, so you actually were able to make it after all, no, I must say, I am surprised, I didn't think you'd be able to make it in time, so you see Naruto there, full three tails fox cloak, because he can't go four tails, and using chakra to basically counteract uh, to counteract basically a bit of the Totsuka blade. Now, the Totsuka blade is a ceiling blade. It's an ethereal blade. So, Naruto can't be in contact with that thing for very long. But, I think what it would actually be doing is absorbing the chakra, specifically for Naruto's uh, fox cloak, more than anything else. And, ultimately, it would uh, it would be absorbing the chakra, but Naruto gets out of the way and says, Sasuke, it's like, yeah, it looks like you can need some help, Sasuke. He's like, I have this all under control, Naruto, but since you're here, you might as well lay a hand. <laughs> His way of saying thank you. So now they're basically just, uh, hold on, uh, hold on, Sasuke, and then he goes back into the three-tail, because just because he loses a three-tail cloak doesn't mean he could go back, couldn't go back into it. That's a lot of chakra the fox has. Goes back into it, gives him basically, not a tail cloak, but he does basically puts a bit of his chakra into Sasuke, give him a boost. He looked tired. He looked tired, man. So Naruto more or less goes back down to his regular cloak form, because he doesn't want to just uh, stay in that form forever, because he can only maintain the form for so long, I'm guessing. Um, even back then, I doubt he could maintain that. He barely was able to keep control of his mentality in third, uh, third state. Uh, this version of Naruto definitely has a lot better control, but still. And Naruto, and Sasuke now gets a nice boost. So you, uh, so you both wish to fight me very well. And then they both come in. He pulls out the shield. Uh, and it's the, the, uh, the Otomir, if you will, which bounces off pretty much every attack. His Susanoo was probably the strongest Susanoo. Simply on the grounds that it had all, like, the three sacred weapons to it. Though the second runner-up, I'd actually put it as Kakashi Susano because it had the ability to use Gamoy Woods with it, which was pretty freaking messed up. Um, so, um, not, so they, they basically go and clash. It's not going to work. So Naruto's like, Sasuke, can you bring the fire? Can you bring the fire? It's like, I can, I get the fire. I was like, I got the fire. I got the then I got the way. Just back me up on this. I think it's gonna be your only chance to really do uh, do any damage to him. So then yeah, basically, is uh, Tachi was like, "What are they planning?" He's coughing up. He's like, "I don't have much time left, but I am curious. Let's see how far that comes." Naruto charges up a tornado fist. Sasuke's basically funneling fire on there, creating a flaming tornado fist. Naruto creates a Ross and Shirk in one tornado uh, with the uh, tornado fist, and basically it engulfs in flames. Uh, and Naruto, the heat's so intense that Naruto is just. You know, he's struggling, but he quickly creates a couple of shadow clones doing the same thing. So the question is, do the shadow clones get through? There, a few clones are, you know, charging in. They get blasted. And then he basically is about to throw it straight at Itachi, who blocks with the Yonamira. But that that turns out to poof. And turns out to be Sasuke the whole time using a very solid uh, illusion, which was straining Sasuke's chakra reserves. And Itachi has this crap. And then Naruto just appears um, uh, from behind probably transformed in some way, and then just fires the collaboration style, Siri Ross and Shark and Tornado Fest, or a wag, that's a, that's a lengthy name, though, I well, could have met, I mean, what was it, the black style, or zero style, how did they basically put that freaking style where they combine Amaterasu with a Ross and Shark in? I don't even remember exactly, zero black style or something like that, so, yeah, not the most contrived named ever, I never, but um, I, let, me, let me think of a quick, uh, better name, real quick. Uh, uh, CR, oh, oh, here's a good one. Collaboration style, Searing Hell Cannon! And just firing, like, punches a flame tornado infused with a 
Russ and Shuriken, we know how strong Russ and Shuriken is, with searing flames, just boom, it hits T Susano right in the back. Now, Susanos are very durable, but can be broken with enough power. That, I think, plus uh, Itachi's in a weakened state. That doesn't just crack. That, I think, shatters Susano after a little bit. I mean, it struggles at first, and then crack, and just, Itachi's just eyes widen, and, and he can't escape, and he's just, just, well done. <laughs> he just gets more or less his backside and center. He basically is able to save, like, is barely saves. A... <laughs> well, well done. So, and basically, what happens is he imparts last words into Sasuke and even says, Sasuke, there's something you need to know before I go. And basically, he gives the briefest of rundowns. Basically, what he did is like, they were planning a coup. I had to do it. I'm sorry, brother. I couldn't do it to you. You were innocent. I'm sorry. I'm so proud of you. And then he just reaches up and briefly just, I love you, little brother. And then he basically, and he also basically just says, take my eyes. Basically asking him, take my eyes. It's like, what? Try to just take my eyes. Trust me, you'll, you will know. You, you will know when the time is right. And to be fair, it makes sense to take his eyes because they are Mange Kyo Sharingan eyes. You don't want those eyes getting in the wrong hands of someone. So they basically, Naruto, because he does know some ceilings, they seal the body uh, and they get the hell out of there while Amara, Amaterasu is still burning. So Zetsu shows up, you know, Zetsu and Toby, uh, Zetsu shows up to Toby and says, yes, the battle is done. Oh, I'll enjoy watching that. I don't know if you will. Uh, oh, and then basically they go back to the scene and it's like, oh, I see. So, Obito is legitimately upset of what's happening right now. Happened right now. It's like, oh, this didn't go as planned. Not at all. Back at the base, he's just talking with Pain. It's like, mm, this is this has become most irritating. This, this isn't how things were supposed to go. Uh, now, Dendro is often doing his own thing. Um, by the way, most of the, the tail beasts would have been caught at this point. That, nothing uh, inhibits that from happening, except for the three tails. So Dendro is uh, Dendro's going to be actually be tasked to get three tails. I I would be willing to bet. I think that is the most reasonable thing. Um, and uh, then all of a sudden, you know, I was like, well, it seems you two could use. It seems your group could use some assistance. Uh, I'd be happy to re to reinstate myself if you're so willing to abide. And then Hiroshimaru is there with Kabuto in tow, and it's like, oh, crap. They're going, they're back together. So, yep, we have Sasuke beating Itachi with a bit of Naruto's help. Uh, them sealing Itachi away, keeping the eyes. Obviously, that'll play a factor in later. And Orochimaru gang, uh, coming to rejoin uh, the Akatsuki because, you know, they want some similar things here. And Dedera's going to be the one. Actually, I, I'm going to take it back. Dedera and um, Orochimaru will probably be the ones who go after the Three Tails. So... Keep your eyes out for that, um, because you usually have to go with at least a partner, and neither of them have a partner. Both their partners are technically dead, uh, so they're both partners. Sasori, then he was partnered with Toby, but Toby clearly, you know, as a to pain basically makes the argument. Toby needs to stay here. I have a mission for him, but you will be paired with Rochimaru, Dedra. Ah, fine, just don't get away in my art, Snake Man. Whatever you say. So that's how it's going to end for part eighteen. We are quickly getting towards the end. I Like I said, I'll probably get another two ver uh, episodes of this one out. So I think I might be able to close it out by the end of the week. We'll see what happens. I might be able to do it. Um, and I'm pretty certain I'll be able to close out the uh, Goku sister, uh, who would, uh, the what if. So anyway, I digress. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, share, subscribe. As always, if you want us to review something, put in the comments below. Let us know the review about at some point. And ideas for who would win, Star Wars, Severe Magic, What If, anything you do on the channel. Put that in the comments below as well. I'll get to that at some point. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'm actually lagging a little bit now I'm noticing. Might be low battery or something. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.